Welcome to Monday Motivation. I'm Tom Connolly, your local leadership coach. In combat operations, the idea of honor translates into trust and intent, where commanders operating in proximity can trust the commanders on their left or their right to do their, to do their duty because they're bound by their honor to accomplishing their, their supporting tasks, their supporting missions to the utmost of their ability. Likewise, seniors minimize supervision by providing intent to subordinates, knowing they are bound by their honor to do what is required to support that intent, often referred to as trust tactics. Hence, we have the introduction of trust as the result of honor and the idea of trustworthiness as a component of honor. Trustworthiness is characteristic of being reliable, dependable, being honest or faithful. With that definition, could you be honorable and trustworthy? So you must be trustworthy to be honorable. And trust is the reliance on the integrity of a person, bringing us here again to the idea, the concept, that integrity underpins honor. But trustworthiness is the effort to be reliable and dependable true to your word and promise. By being reliable and dependable, we exercise trustworthiness and we take on our moral workout of integrity in order to build honor. So this week, listen to what you say. Look at what you do. Are you building your honor? It's easier if you have a code to follow. And that's what we will talk about next time. I'm Tom Connolly. Remember, all things are possible with prayer and heavy deadlifts.